In this video, I'll be reviewing the Fifine Ampligame H6 headset. These are some budget headphones made especially with features that are important for gamers. So today we're gonna take a look at these and I'll give you my own opinion. But first, let's start to check what was included in the box. So this was the box that they came in. First, we have some documentation here with a manual showing you how to use the headset with the different features. And here we have the headset itself. If we remove this cardboard piece, this reveals the whole cable here. And one of the first thing that strikes me is, although they're not small headphones, they're very light. And finally, we have the microphone that comes separately. And this is a great thing because you can detach it when you don't need it. And when you're ready to play, you just have to plug it back. Connecting them to my Mac was very easy. I just have to plug them in my USB port and that was it. My Mac automatically recognized them. I was able to select it and use them. The hardware has these RGB stripes shining on each side of the headphones. I wish you can turn these off or select a specific color, but in this case you can. This is not a big deal, I still think it's very cool, especially in the dark. If you have people around, they will surely ask you what are these, because they're very special looking. Let's talk about the comfort. Many people will wear these gaming many hours at the time. I have an average size head for an adult and I was able to wear these about 3 hours before I felt the pressure compressing my head. The cups of these headphones are hugging your ear, which means they are not on it pressing, they are just around it, which makes it much more easier to wear for a longer time. It's very easy to adjust those headphones and the top band is well padded something that sometimes misses when you're talking about budget headphones. These headphones are featuring a control unit that is on the cable itself. There's many features that can be activated and deactivated using it. So let me show you. On the front we have this very large 7.1 button. When you press it, it turns red and you feel it automatically because the sound stage of what you're listening changes completely. It's hard to describe, but it's trying to mimic a home theater where each sound is separated from the other. Then we have this minus and plus button that are huge as well, that controls the volume. So you don't have to look at this, you automatically know where to press. On the left side, we have an AQ button and you have three separate presets that you can choose. My favorite was the first one, it's the movie mode, that's how they call it. It has a good balance of bass, but also trebles. I just found the middle one missing bass and the last one missing some clarity. But again, I just keep it at the first one and I'm good for every situation. And finally, on the other side, we have a mute button, a switch. So you can mute the mic at any time so no one listens to what you're saying. Even though these headphones are packed with features, the thing that surprised me the most is the mic. Just to give you an idea how good is the microphone, everything that you're hearing in this video has been recording using the built-in mic of these headphones. I didn't expect it to be so good because for gaming headphones, usually the mic is not the most important thing. Well, in this case, I feel they invested a lot of effort to make something great. I'm even thinking recording my next voiceovers using these headphones because it's more convenient than having a separate mic. It may take you a few trial and error to position the mic perfectly, but since it's flexible, you'll be able to find the perfect spot where your voice sound the best. Overall, I think these headphones are a great value. And not only for gamers. If you're a creative person, editing videos or even making music where audio quality is important but also sometimes you like to record some voiceovers or having a zoom call where the mic quality needs to be good, these won't deceive you. And obviously, if you're a gamer, everything I said before also applies to you. 
If you would like to check them out on Amazon, I have put a link in the description. You also support my channel by using this link. And if you have any questions, just type them down below. Leave a like and subscribe to this channel. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.